I'm out here for y'all now. The next generation. I got everything I wanted. You understand me? I had a dream. And I got it. From nothing to a smile. Mm. You understand? Money's not the success. Who? If you got a smile on your face, mm. it's success. So, get it out there. Kendrick Johnson's mother has to wake up every morning knowing somebody's walking around with her baby's organs in them. She made them organs. Mm. Oh, come on, go deep if you're going with me. She developed this baby's right. organs for nine months of her life. Do you understand me? And somebody's walking around with them. And they ain't his. And it ain't him. Do the right thing. Understand me? I am unafraid. You come to me. And like Maxine Waters, you better shoot straight. We're getting this case reopened. And we're going to get justice for the Johnson family. What made you want to get involved? What else? They took his organs. And what else made me want to get involved? They asked me to do it. And why did I accept? Because I care. I care about our children. I care about them killing our children. So I will be in the streets. I will be protesting. I will be going to Congress. I will be doing whatever I can do for the Johnson family. Are we clear? Yes, ma'am. I came to sleep. Exactly. You understand? Yes. Go ahead. What is it? Um, so this documentary is coming, you know, along the heels of another case out of Chicago. So um, many cases. So many out of cases. So many places. Definitely. Yes. Um, specifically, the Jelani Day case. Um, what What would you say to his parents or his mother as they fight I for answers? I would say, never stop. Oh. To have come this far in this country and then have to watch them just kill our kids. All they were doing it before, but we couldn't see it. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, living on video. So, when you hear me doing something, you show up. Cause I'm just gonna show up for y'all. I got everything I wanted. I did it. Funny girl. Still healthy. Look at that. Oh, yeah. That leg. I was that. Look at that. Look at that. that it ain't that kind of part. <laughs> but listen, still can, still healthy. Yeah. 64. Nice. Come on. Still working in Hollywood? Right. They throw you out at 40 in Hollywood. Right. They can't throw me out because I love it. Yes. You understand? Oh, yeah. I love what I do. You. you can't stop love. Oh, yeah. No. Trust me, we love you. Oh, so you, when you see me coming, show up, you hear me? Because I'm showing up for something. Do you understand? I ain't got to come out of my house. But I'm coming out for you. Because I was too young to fight for you in the 60s. And then my generation got lazy. We thought things were going to be all right. Affirmative action. Folks were acting like they had some sense. And then the internet. Come on. <laughs> Look what's going on. The world is watching. And if we don't stand up for our own, oh, who's going to do that? Who's going to stand up for us 
if we don't stand up. So, do the right thing. I'm talking to all of y'all. Do the right thing. Make sure you put a filter on this.